Hey everybody on YouTube, this is Mr. Pokemon Selling Away, and today I'm gonna talk to you guys about a one game on my Nintendo Switch, and this is Contra Rule Corps. This game is coming out this Tuesday for Nintendo Switch, Xbox One, PlayStation 4. Some people hate it, and I can see why, because I hate the game too. I mean, we all know what Contra is. Contra is a great game that started on the NES tons of years ago. It was a 2D side-scroller shooter. You could shoot in all directions, and it's just by you killing aliens. I mean, it was pretty cool. Over the years, the game series would get a little in weirder territories, but maintain the fun Contra experience. This, however, is not fun. It's not fun. And, uh, hold on, let me position the camera so you can better see it. I think that's good. I'm going to show you what I experienced from this dreadful game. Now, now, what I'm showing you is the demo. It's not the full game. I know the full game could be improvement, but who knows it will be. Because it's not a very good game. Look at the graphics. Graphics look terrible on handheld. It just looks terrible. I mean, on the clock, so check your on now I know what you say. Now I know what you're gonna say. Oh, um, it's on a handheld on TV. It's gonna look so much better. Duh. Fine. Let me show you. Let me show you. What do you think now? No, I, I'm showing you. I'm going to show you how bad this game looks. Does that look any better? Anything better at all? Look at that car on flames. No, it really doesn't. So yeah. This game is terrible. And I'm going to show you why. So yeah, you move around the seat. Oh wait, got to my Joy-Cons on. Yeah, I got two pairs in case if another player wants to play with me. So yeah, let's play this god awful game. So there you go, uh, L moves you around, that moves the, wherever you want to shoot at. B jumps, but for some reason they thought B wasn't enough, so now you can jump with L. Why with L? I mean, have you ever played a game where L makes you jump? I mean, B is enough, why can't it just be B and that's it? Why does it gotta be L? Come on, make up your mind. Drag all the fiends. Yeah. Yeah, I know. Oscar winning acting right there. Yeah, really Oscar winning. I want to make you hear it.
You don't want to shoot the gun too much or else it'll stall. Oh my god, the graphics look so bad. is there to expect? I mean, the game is so bland and everything, it lacks originality. J -j just look at that! Look, 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 look at the graphics, like, right around here. It looks so bad. It looks like a game that came out for Nintendo Wii, but with Nintendo 64 style graphics. It's like one of those, like, Wii shovelware games. And a not very good one, too jeopardizing the franchise it's on. Yeah, this doesn't look too good. If you think that was cool, then you are blind. Not great, there's bombs all over the place. Oh, you see that? Is that when they explode, they jump on the screen? I mean, it's too cartoonish, I mean. The one thing that I do like about this game, and only one thing about it is that it has the spread gun, it has the classic Contra weapon, which is pretty good. Too bad it lasts up for a minute, I wish it could last up longer. Wait, I didn't know Wolverine was in here. Okay, tell me right now that does not look nothing like Wolverine. What? He kills you in one swipe? You guys saw that, right?
See, look, my gun has to reload, I'm getting annihilated by enemies. My god, man. I want you to look at this scene too. He kicks a tank. In what video game does a video game character kick a tank? It's so stupid. I mean like, why would they jeopardize a franchise this badly? It's bringing me flashbacks of Spider-Man Homecoming. That's how bad it is. Oh yeah, uh, one thing you're gonna know right off the bat is that, oh, I have to pause the game. No pause feature. There is no pause feature on there. The only pause feature that has is for you to go back home. So let's just say you have a phone call, you have to go eat dinner, you gotta use the bathroom. You can't do none of that because there's no pause feature in the game. So you gotta do everything fast. Like super fast, like Speedy Gonzalez fast or The Flash fast. I'm trying to be a level I got a phone call ringing, my food's probably burning, smoke's all over the place. I have a huge piss puddle in the middle of my floor, and then I have to call him back. If I miss one, I have to leave a message saying, Oh, sorry, I'm playing Contra Road Corps on my Nintendo Switch, and there's no pause feature, so sorry, I'll call you back in like a few hours from now. What a stupid move. Whenever you're making a game, have a pause feature. I mean, take a look at all these games I got. Look at all these games I got. They all have pause buttons. They got something where you could stop the game, go do something, and then you could come back and play it again. I mean, I know this game doesn't have it because it's, it's online multiplayer. But all these other games got it. Except for that one. Except for this one right here. All of these damn games got pause buttons except for that one right there. Does that even make any sense? No, it doesn't. I don't even want to play this game. I, I, I don't even want to play it. I just want to annihilate this with a missile. I just want to go back in time, wherever this game was created, and just override the systems to wherever this game was made from. I don't know if you all want to play the game more or not because after hearing that, oh, I'm going to shoot down this effer. <sighs> this game is, this game is shit. This game is shit. <laughs> Oh, 
Oh, you gotta shoot the gate down too? Wow, how original, guys. Oh, what is that? What? All my help to plead like that? What were those things coming out the ground? Was it like whole, whole, uh, I don't know. I don't know what to call them. We'll just call them. I don't know what name to give them. Oh, another one. Another one of those whole things. I don't know what is that. See, look, the gun stalls. Why can't I just constant rapid fire? Whatever happened to that? Wolfenstein and Doom got rapid fire, and those are good games. But this, this takes it a step further, and decides to give you something that's not even legit. God, there's enemies swarming all over the place. It makes it... Oh my god. Oh, uh, the, the missiles overheat too? Oh man, this is, this is, this is garbage. His health, look at that, his health's depleted and he's still up. Alright, well, I don't want to watch no more, I don't want to watch no more. So, to sum up, I just deleted it. 
This game is horrible. I mean, without a doubt, the lowest point ever for Contra. I mean, I don't know why they would do this to Contra. Maybe they're just trying to do, like, a fresh coat of paint for the series. But if the original ain't broke, don't fix it. Leave it how it is. Oh, man. There's not even enough words to describe how bad that was. I mean, the graphics are terrible. I mean, I know it's the Switch, so Xbox version, PlayStation 4 version. Well, those are bad, too. Anyway, this game is coming out the 24th of September. Am I getting it? Hell no. Are people going to get it? Definitely not, because if they played the demo and they didn't like it, they're probably not going to get it either. So yeah, that was my review of Contra Road Corpse on the Switch. I just think it's a not good game. It's just not good. Anyways, thank you guys for watching. Until next time, see you in the next game review. Bye. And do not play this game. Do not play it. It's 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 not good. Don't don't play it.